All right, so yesterday we had a lot of rain. It's Friday night into Saturday, four to seven inches, somewhere in that range in this area. And this is where all the rain drains into in our subdivision. And last year we had a pump system put in that was to basically lift the water out of the division into a local creek. So when this fills up with water, instead of it sitting here and piling up over time and, and you know accumulate over rainfall, that system would lift the water through a uh, through a pump station and through a force main into the local creek and evacuate the water, keeping this area dry. So as you can see in the video there, that's where the French drain is underground, and it leads up to here. And here's the surface drain and also an access. You can kind of see through the grate there. Um, there's where the French drain flows into the collection container here. And there is, off to the side here, you can see it down in there. That's the inlet into the pump station itself. So kind of get a shot there of that. A little bit of water in there right now. Not enough to meet the threshold to get into the pump station or the lift station, if you will. So back again, French drain. Need a little more rock work here, kind of to stabilize the ground. But yesterday, as I'm going to show through some pictures and video, this was working really hard to lift the water out of this area to prevent flooding and backfilling into our basements. So I'm going to take you over to the pump station, and it's right over here. So this was put in last year, actually just completed several months ago as they started the work. And down in this container, this is the lift station here. Um, and like I said, you'll see in the video of it working uh, that follows this video itself. You'll see the, there's two pumps, two levels. Uh, there's, a, there's an initial pump, and then when it kind of gets to an overflow stage, a second pump comes on. And here's the little concrete pad. Kind of shows, uh, you know, this is where it's all controlled from, where the electricity comes in. And we've got our controllers in there to run the pump station. So two pumps, two floats, and you're going to see a lot of water in the video. And so a little more, kind of give you a little better picture of what's going on. So, check it out. So is this operated through the city utilities or? No, it's uh, through the county drainage board. Drainage board, okay. Uh, city utilities has agreed to if uh, someone calls uh, locate to do some digging, and they'll do locates for city utilities will. Okay. So uh, this area has grown so much since I've moved out here. How long have you been out here? Just three years, I think. So I was a fourth house in this edition. Okay, this is 20 plus now. And I mean, all that area back there with all just farms and land still, it has grown up so much. And you would never dream of Shadow Creek got a big look out of where. Yep, we got one out of room. Well, that looks like it's pretty clean water, except for a little bit of dervish here. Yep. Hey, 
dump. We can put a little trash up into the dump before it closes. You guys have a good weekend. Take care. It's nice meeting you. Yeah, nice meeting you. I'm Danny Fields. Good. That thing moves some water. Yeah. 